what's going on guys and welcome to the witcher um i have played the witcher 3 still haven't finished it <laughs> because i started it and just never got back to it but i'm almost at the end i think i'm on the final mission um of the main story because that that this that game i mean i know there's a lot of people rushing back you know, or doing a playthrough again on YouTube, whatever, whatever. But this game is so vast. It's such a good open world game. And the story is also very good. So when I was playing um, back in, I finally got a chance to play it over the summer. And I was playing it. I was basically addicted to it over the summer. Um, just getting a couple hours in here and there. Um, so, but there's so many side missions in this game. It's absolutely like, it's so much can get you really distracted and you want to, you know, try to get the, the best armor and all of this other stuff. Like you're striving to get those really good armors in the game. You know what I'm saying? The, 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 um, the master armors and, and stuff like that. And the, the different treasures that you got to find for the different, um, you know the cat and the 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 wolf and the the different schools and stuff like that. You're trying to get these armor sets that are really cool that you can get those extra attributes for. You want to you you know you get into it. You want to get these things done. Um, so I know there's a lot of people going back to it now, but then they came out with um with the Netflix um show. But I heard that this is more based on the books more than it's based. Um, it's based on the books more than it's based on the actual video game. I think the video game is a different story from the from the actual books, which is something that I that I want to go back and check out too. The books, but I do hear that there's a lot of hype around the Netflix show, and if the fans are happy, that means it's good. Because I remember um, a lot of people, there were people upset with the Marvel series that were on on Netflix, no matter how good they were. Some of them were trash. You know, I he um, Iron Fist was trash. Like, I never liked the first or the second season. Like, I think what really um, was bad about Iron Fist was the acting. The acting was terrible. The choreography was terrible too. All the others I liked to some degree. Didn't I? Didn't really like the second season of Jessica Jones. It was okay. It was an okay season. You get what I'm saying? But the acting in Jessica Jones is really good. There were some tear jerky moments. Um, you know, I think Daredevil, Daredevil, and um, the the other one. <laughs> I can't remember. I cannot. Luke Cage. Yes, Luke Cage. I think those were the best series from Marvel on Netflix. Um, ever since they took him off of Netflix, you know, I have, I know they're not going to be there anymore. They're going to be on the, I don't know if they're going to start over on Disney plus, but we'll see. Um, but in any case, I, that, that was the only reason for me to hold on to a Netflix subscription until now. So we're going to be checking out, um, we're going to be checking this out. Um, the way how I'm going to do this is just like how I've always done it, but, but these videos are not going to be on BitChute. The reason why I'm, why I'm doing this is because I kind of want to keep it internal because it just came out. You get what I'm saying? So if you guys want to see it, you could go to the Google drive and see it, but I'm not going to be putting this on BitChute. So whoever watches my videos on BitChute, too bad. If you can't watch it on Google drive, I'm not putting these on bitch you as a matter of fact i might not even keep these reactions up for very long because you know <laughs> you get what i'm saying netflix is one of those um sites that really really like they will come down on you so i'm trying to kind of kind of keep it internal a little bit than to put it on bitch shoot you know so if it's just a hundred of you guys watching that's fine just let just let me know you know what I'm saying? Like, I just don't feel comfortable with putting it on BitChute. So if you have, if you're new to the channel and this is the first time you actually know what it is, we take a pause. You can go watch it and come back. I'll do a review for the episode. So let's go watch this and I will see you guys for the review. All 
All right, so The Witcher episode one. <laughs> Yo, this show, this show, going to one episode, there's eight, right? There's eight episodes. Right, so we should finish this up pretty quickly. Oh, man. I, I, there's a lot of, you know stuff out there for you to read you know that i've read leading up to this nothing about the story you know what i'm saying i don't know anything about the plot or what they're trying to do here as in i was not spoiled but man <laughs> you know what i'm saying like the stuff that people were saying you know the reviews and stuff like that incredible incredible and just from the one episode, I can tell that they really are trying to be as authentic as possible, staying true to what the author of this series is really about. And they also include some, some, you know, some of that good choreography and fighting. That that scene was a one shot, right? That whole thing was a one shot. I love scenes like that because it kind of show you good camera work. You know, and also there was no cuts. It was just the camera just swinging around. And that's awesome. When you get one shots like that, I remember they did that for the end of Creed part, um, Creed, um, the first Creed movie. And that was awesome. The end, the, the last fight was a one shot. And that, it's not easy to do. You get what I'm saying? It's not very easy to do to, to, for them to shot. You can imagine they did it over and over and over again to make sure they do that one time and it's done right and to do it really good like that was really awesome so no cuts just straight one shot just camera work no cut to a different camera or nothing like that it's a straight action for good what was that a good i want to say that scene took maybe about 30 minutes 30 seconds to a minute right so pretty cool man so I like that most of all. I like the story that they're trying to tell. Um, also, I didn't even recognize that it was actually Siri. I know she had um, in in the, in the video game. She had she's of royalty. So, but I wasn't kind. I wasn't putting two and two together because I, I you know I don't really know. I mean, you're I'm watching this as if I'm watching something new. But of course, I know some of the characters. I know Yennefer. Uh, even though. I don't know they we haven't seen her yet um i know about um we know Geralt, of course he's the main character um siri um he mentioned his trainer for a minute there i can't remember his name right now but he did mention it when he was talking to roach before um before she, whole girl came there and was talking to him ren renfrey right so that was beautifully done, and to tell you could tell that they were trying to to set up stuff for the rest of the season, but also give you something that makes you want to watch episode two. You get what I'm saying? So they did complete, kind of complete a story, a short story, to kind of get you into what The Witcher is about. Basically, showing you that no matter where this guy goes, he's kind of hated. In some sort of way, no matter the relationships that he bought, and that's how it is in the video game too. Nobody really likes you; they just kind of tolerate you. And you know, if it's if it's mutually beneficial, you know what I'm saying. Even people who has who you know, if, if from every mission that you do in the game, whether it be a side mission or whatever, you would always find that you get these choices that you can choose to. You, you, you know what I'm saying? You can make the right choice or whatever. You could tell people, hey, do this instead of this or whatever the situation is. So I dig that aspect of the show kind of trying to portray that also kind of kind of mixing in things. You know what I'm saying? Um, obviously, that's not how I played The Witcher 3. That's not how it started, um, you know, with the introduction of Siri and stuff like that. You know, Siri being you know them she's on the run they're looking for her that's what happens in in the video games you know what i'm saying on the road we meet yennefer and other interesting characters you know what i'm saying um there's also triss which is another love interest of Geralt. you triss and yennefer is the love interest so i don't know if we're going to ever meet them in this story so there's there's a lot to take in 
but I like this first episode. Definitely going to continue with this series, man. I know you guys are saying, why don't you do this instead of this? Um, I just want to knock this out because I'm a huge Witcher fan. I am a Witcher fan who have never read, read the books, just played the video games. So, <laughs> so um, I am going to get into the book. Maybe that's something I'll do over on Patreon because that's where I do read-throughs and stuff like that. So um, I might add that to Patreon later on you know, after I, you know, get through Game of Thrones and stuff like that. Right now, I'm only doing manga, but for this year, this year coming up, I'm definitely planning to do, to add more to the arsenal over there on Patreon. Um, so, yeah, I'm looking forward to more of this, man. That one shot was nuts, was crazy, loved it. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. If you're here, remember, I'm not going to be putting this on BitChute, so, so don't ask. If you can't watch it on if you can't watch it on the Google Drive, I feel sorry for you. I can't <laughs> I can't help you. I can't help you. I I'm just not going to put this on BitChute. Like it literally just came out last week, guys. If you want to watch it, get a Netflix. Um if you can't watch it on Google Drive with me where I can where I'll be able, you know what I'm saying, where I can have some sort of limitations to it because at least, you know, I don't have droves of people watching it. You know what I'm saying? These are full reactions, so I, I definitely got to be careful, okay? I don't want my channel to get shut down because <laughs> because I'm over here. I'm already, uh, it's already wrong what I'm doing. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, just to get around all the red tape for YouTube, I'm doing it this way. So, but I'm going to try to cut it. Maybe later on. I will upload them to BitChute later on when every, when the hype kind of dies down. But the thing haven't even been out a month yet. You know what I'm saying? So I don't want to I don't want to jump the gun. You know what I mean? So thank you guys so much for tuning in, man. It's been great. Um it was a great it was a great watch. Thank you guys so much. Leave a comment. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. There's more to come. There's other stuff you can check out on the channel, of course. Leave a comment in the comment section. Leave a like. I will catch you guys later, man. Peace. Terabyte out.